today is the Garnier shoot. I'm just going to have a shower. It is like oh god it's 10 to 6 in the morning my taxi's coming in about half an hour my bags are packed i'm not taking all these bags but my bags are packed i don't know what i'm gonna wear this morning so i have so many outfits laid out i was like i'll decide when i get out of the shower and now it's this morning and i'm about to go in the shower and i still have no idea what i want to wear but yes i'm so so excited i still just like mentally can't believe we're going to paris to film a tv advert what the heck like i'm gonna be in a tv advert let's get ready and go I'm here at St Pancras now, I'm just waiting outside the meeting point to meet everyone else who's on the shoot with me and the team from Garnier. I'm excited, I think I'm the first here, so I'm just waiting at the meeting point now and we're gonna meet up with everyone else, jump on the Eurostar and head to Paris. Okay guys, we're just pulling into Paris. Oh, hi girl. Oh, oh. <laughs> I was like not vlogging on the train because it's like everyone was like very serious. We're like in a nice little business seat, but we're pulling into Paris now, so I'll catch you when we get to the hotel. Okay guys, so we're in the hotel and I've not vlogged here before, but this is actually my absolute favorite hotel in Paris. I stayed here last year with Shiseido on a brand trip. Absolutely fell in love with this hotel. I'm very grateful for Garnier bringing me out here and booking this hotel for us. I have to show you the room. It's absolutely just to die for. Little details for me. A separate toilet to the rest of the room. You walk in, you've got this gorgeous mirror <laughs> and a gorgeous seating area inside. It's just stunning, stunning details. Look at this feature where the bed is and then of course a gorgeous little terrace with just the most gorgeous view even on a wet miserable february last day of february and then you've got the little bar area so cute and then of course the pièce de résistance is this insane bathroom you may have seen some of your faves post content from this bathroom. I feel like a lot of content creators stay at this hotel because the bathroom is just absolutely a big serve. It's a big serve, what can I say? So yes, we are here. Hotel is stunning. Everyone is incredible. I'm so, so excited to be here. I actually cannot believe that I'm in Paris to film a TV advert. What the hell? Like, when did this become my life? Anyway, I'm gonna quickly get ready because we're gonna go and have a little spot of lunch together because everyone is hungry now. There's one tiny, tiny thing that I want to buy, but I feel like if I don't buy it, it's not the end of the world. I'd like to try and get something cute for my boyfriend because it's his birthday, so hopefully I can just pop into a cute shop. Um, but I think we're going to eat lunch here because the weather is just, it's a bit crap, isn't it? Let's face it. And then have some free time in the afternoon before we go for dinner this evening. Then tomorrow morning, wake up, go to set, film the advert, go back to London, and that will be it. That will be the whole trip done oh guys honestly i'm so grateful thank you so much everyone for all of your support like i i can't even put into words how just insane this this whole thing is incredible lunch here at the hotel the weather is not great outside it's still chucking it down so we just decided to eat here and have lunch which was I would say a very wise decision guys what I had packed to wear to lunch today I should leave in my suitcase so basically I'm leaving the hotel at like 6 a.m. tomorrow to go to the set and I need to take all of my stuff with me so I just need to take out like what I'm gonna wear to the set and what I'm wearing to dinner this evening in my suitcase to avoid packing, unpacking, you know, all that malarkey. So I need these jeans for tomorrow. This is my outfit for tonight. I'm gonna wear these blue jeans. These are from Abercrombie and Fitch. I picked these up because I have them in black already and they're so comfy. These are the 90 straight ultra high rise. Look at the color of them, just gorgeous. So I think I'll wear these tomorrow to the set with, picked up another white shirt in Jigsaw today because I was just paranoid. <laughs> as I said when I was packing, but I didn't have a white shirt. I've got lots of white t-shirts I can take to set, but I just think like a white linen shirt, it's gonna look crisp together. So I'm gonna hang these up so that in the morning, I can just pop them on and head to the set. Just such a lovely, lovely place. I'm so happy to be here. I am, um, I'm gonna do like, I'm going to do an hour of work now 
and just catch up with the girls, make sure that everything is good to go. I've got like an ad to post tomorrow. So I wanna make sure that everything is ready for that and it's all prepped and primed. products so i've got my toothbrush makeup I'm loving this this is the new sol de janeiro body lotion in delicia drench and the texture is like a lot thicker than the products i've tried from the brand before it's very like moussey but it's absolutely bloody gorgeous i can't get enough of it i am going to do some work now i've got an hour that i've blocked out for myself to get some work done um, before I need to get ready. So it's four o'clock now, five o'clock I'll start getting ready and then we're meeting at like six, 6.30. So that gives me ample time to get some shit done and charge my devices. So I will catch up with you guys when I'm getting ready. I was thinking of wearing like a black turtleneck with this black Gucci skirt I have, but I'm wearing this Skims dress, like an underdress, and I'm actually tempted to just wear that, the skirt. It's a bit risque, but also it's Fashion Week, it's Paris. If you can't do a little bodysuit with a skirt during Fashion Week, when can you? Let's put this together and see what it looks like. Just gonna wear this Harrods fragrance. I absolutely love this. A little extra Dio. And a little fragrance oil. I just like to put this like where I want my skin to be a bit shinier. Guys, so do you come after the Paris? I wish. I, I was actually here um, in October. Gosh, guys, what an amazing evening. Honestly, just such beautiful people, amazing food. I just I can't believe it. I know I keep saying it, I know it's gonna sound really annoying, but I'm like, I actually cannot believe that tomorrow I'm shooting a TV advert. What the heck? Like tomorrow we're shooting a TV advert for Garnier. What? I've been talking to my manager and I was just like, thank you so, so much. I mean, there's so many things that go into making this a job. So many people that go into making this a job. And to be honest, it doesn't have to be that way. And a lot of people don't run it that way. But the way that I like to run it is that this is my business. <laughs> and to run a business, you need great people around you. And I'm just so, so, so grateful for the amazing women who work for me or with me that are every day uplifting me, especially with what I've been through the past couple of months health-wise. Like, oh gosh, guys, I can't even put into words how just unbelievably grateful I am for the community and of people that I have working around me to keep things going and to still keep me in conversations with brands and all of these things. Like, it's just literally mind-blowing. And I really, really feel like this year is gonna be, not like my best year ever, but I feel like it's gonna be my best year to date. I've come through such a horrible <laughs> horrible time i cannot believe i have this air of not even optimism because i just know it's going to be incredible because i know that i work so hard i work so incredibly hard and i have such incredible people that work so hard around me as well you can't you can't outwork hard work you cannot outwork it i'm gonna wash my face now have a shower because it is oh God, it's five to ten i've got to wake up at 20 past five at the hotel to get to set tomorrow morning and yeah i will say one thing though about this makeup no pro makeup artist i definitely still could probably blend a lot more but you girl uche said we need to wear more makeup and i i uh, it's not agreeing because it's not for me to disagree or disagree but she's right is what i'm trying to say um my under eye i'm always chronically complaining about my under eye creasing I actually just applied more setting powder and my under eye doesn't look anywhere near as bad as it does when I use a tiny dusting of powder. So word to Uche, apply more makeup. My skincare routine this evening is the same as what I've done for the past month. My micellar water, my cleanser and then my Vitsi and that is going to be it. That is... I am the first. I mean, you'd hope I'd be the first. I did wait, well, not, uh, not because of anything like that. You'd hope I'd be the first because of how early I woke up. I am the first. Um, it is five to seven this morning and we're just getting ready to start with like hair. I mean, I say hair, not hair, to get ready with makeup. Um, I think they're gonna put like some, like a very pale, like manicure on me. And I'm not allowed to wear SPF this morning because one of the shots we're doing is with the UV camera, which is really, really cool. I'm so, honestly so excited for you guys to see this content. I mean, I say content, I'm so excited for you guys to see this TV advert. 
Um, but yeah, like I have like a whole like board with everything. I'll show you like everything we're gonna do today. But yeah, I'm very very excited. So I'm not allowed to wear like any SPF or any skincare products So I don't think there'll be any makeup for that But I think later on in the day when we do like an interview segment And they'll ask me like about my experience using the products That maybe I'll have like a bit of light makeup which is nice um, But I am having my nails done I feel like a little princess on set um, But yeah, it's really really fun, really really nice It's very very sleepy vibes, I think everyone is <laughs> Sleepy this morning And yeah, I'll take you on set when we go through But it's like a full full production there's a lot of people here a lot of people guys we just did like a uv camera shot so it's like well showing all the dance well thank you and this is some other set look it's so cool okay i don't know where i'm going next but they're filming so i'm keeping very quiet so cool <laughs> Guys, we're about to film the last scene of the day. It is 4 p.m. and I'm going to do my busier scan. So this is going to be the same machine that we use at the L'Oreal head office to get the before and after pictures. So we're getting some like contextual content. So this is the set. There's a busier scanner. I've used these a few times now because they get like the really in-depth pictures of your skin, which is, I mean, that's a bit embarrassing to be honest. Sees it all. But anyway. I will um, oh God, catch up with you guys after because then I'm finished and we'll be wrapped for the day and I'm so so excited so this is the set here look at this guys it's got like for the camera so cool okay I'll catch you in a sec oh guys we're done I can feel dent in my head from uh, pressing against the vis yet look and just like that the set is going down that's a wrap the day is done I'm gonna go and find the rest of the team but this is like what they could see when we were shooting on the screen so you can see the busier scanner and I've got little dots in my head now from it but it was a lot of fun this is the rest of the set ah okay let's get back to London shall we let's go home